I'm a tutor at the Mazda. So behind me is the Mazda, which is a 2500 building, and next to us is the gym. So you can know where to find us. So the first thing that you'll be able to see once you come into the Math Lab is the schedule of the tutors. So we offer tutoring from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. from Monday to Thursday and then from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. on Fridays. And then we also offer tutoring on Saturdays from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. And you can see all the times the tutors work on uh, in this board. We also have the classes that the tutors can offer in this board up here. So if you come in and you're wondering what classes can they help you with, um, this gives you a list of what they can actually um, have experience with. And then in the board you'll be able to see that some tutors have an underline under the names. That means that they actually know statistics. So if you have questions from your Math 119 class, you can come in and they, they'll, these people will be able to help you with that. Um, we also offer some handouts. So let's say if you have some questions on your classes, you can just get um, one of these uh, handouts and they'll be able to help you or inform you on some subjects that you might be having questions and then we are not allowed to bring drinks into a math lab so if you're bringing your cup from Jack from Subway or anywhere you can just put it here at the table so after you come in and see the schedule you have to sign in into this computer so how you sign it well you have to put your key number without the G. Once you do that, you're gonna select the class you're coming for and then the reason you have. So that might be just to use one of the study rooms or just to do homework and maybe to get tutoring. So what we do is that we offer walk-in tutoring. So let's say that you come in, we have 48 computers available for you. Once you sit down and you wanna do your homework and then you have questions, you get these little papers that we have in each um, computer and then it says tutoring assistance required so if you have the question just put it on top of the pc and that lets the tutor the tutors know that you actually have a question and then they can approach to you we also have um a printer so the cost of each print is five cents and if you want to call it print then it's gonna be ten cents so we have like a new printer right now and then we have more handouts right here some staplers scratch paper So we also have two study rooms. Um, in the cabinets you can find old textbooks, so let's say that you want to look more into some type of problem that you're having in one of your classes, well you can use one of those textbooks to get more information about that. Um, let's say you want to get together with your classmates and then study for that cop test, statistics, do a recording for your stats class, well you can come into the study rooms. We have two whiteboards, actually three, one graphing one. We also have several tables, several chairs, and then we also have this TV. So the TV is only for educational purposes. So let's say you wanna look at some slide from your classes and you want everyone to look at it, you can use the TV for that. Say you're taking a class like trigonometry or statistics and you are in the need of a graphing calculator, then you can come to us, we rent those out. But first you have to go to the cashier's window and pay $10, then you get a receipt and you have to bring that to us. Then we will be able to provide you the graphing calculator and that's for the whole semester. We also have the textbooks for each math course in IVC, so if you don't have your own book and you want to look at the problems for your homework, you can come to us, bring us your ID, and then you can borrow a textbook. Those are only allowed to be used in the math lab, so you can use them outside of the lab. We also have videos for our classes from Math 61 to Calculus and Statistics. So if you want more information on those subjects, you can totally use the videos and then if you don't have your own headphones, we also have those for you. The Math Lab also offers regular workshops for classes from Math 61 to Math 91. Um, and then we also offer around the end of the semester final reviews workshops for the students to get prepared for their finals in their math courses. All of this information can be found on the website on imperial.edu and then you go to Math Lab and you can find the schedule of the tutors, the information on graphing calculators and everything that has been talked about in this video. Thank you!